In this video, we will be covering usage of StoreView Web, which is our newest web-based tool to connect from a PC into our SM800 or SM800A system managers. To access the tool, you would want to open up a web browser on your PC, this can be Chrome or Edge, and type in the link svw for storeviewweb.danfoss.com. That would bring you to the login page that you're seeing here. The first setting on this page that we need to look at is HTTP or HTTPS. We can click on the slide bar here to either enable or disable that setting. This would need to match the setting in your system manager itself. So SM800 would always be HTTP. Uh, SM800A, there's a setting under your COM tab in your controller that will decide whether we're using HTTP or HTTPS for that connection. So you would want this to match that setting in the controller. From there, we can enter in either a numerical IP address or a host name tied to that in, um, in the first field. And then just our, our regular credentials here to log into the controller with the name and password. And this would then bring us to our standard login screen or home screen rather where we can make changes, navigate through the controller, etc. If we open up a new tab here, to connect to a second site, this site we will not be using HTTPS, this would be a site with just HTTP. You can see when I enter this IP address into that field that there's a warning message I'm receiving. So and this may be something you run into depending on the IP address of your, your controller. Web browsers identify certain ranges of IP addresses as internal or local. Um, in this case, it's a 192.168 that falls within that range that prompts this warning. When you run into this, you will see the prompt to download a desktop version of the app. Once you've downloaded the, the program or the app from the link provided in the web browser, you'll want to go ahead and install the software and then open it up. You'll be presented with a screen that's identical to what you would have from a, a web browser view of the same tool. So from here, we can enter in our IP address again, and then our credentials. And again, identical from if we were, were connected using the StoreView web tool um, directly out of the browser. We're, we're now into the home screen where we can navigate and make changes, etc.